This is an original 1964 deluxe microbus, 21 windows, soft top roof. Uh, we took it, completely renovated it. It's completely 100% electric. So this is a project that came out of Volkswagen, Volkswagen of America's electronics research lab. Well, this is sort of our theme car for 2006. We put a multitude of projects in here, and they all showed, sort of so, showcase the technologies that we're working on in the lab. Some are just quite, you know, quite zany that you would never actually see in a car. Wait, what? What's the most zany <laughs> thing about it? This is a palm vein recognition oh, sensor. It's pretty cool. Oh. It's not happening. Right we'll just go with the standard breaking and entering. Um, but yeah, this is e-paper. So this is a thin, flexible electrophoretic display. The blinker lights and the headlights and taillights were all designed in conjunction with Osram Sylvania. It's got a home theater style special screen in there. We've got a projector spitting an image out. And as you can see, it's, it turns translucent. And this happens when you apply high voltage um, to it. The current causes the liquid crystals, crystals inside to align. I mean, it, it's actually quite powerful. I've driven it up to 45, 50 miles an hour, and it, I, it felt fine there. I'm sure it could go a lot further, but this baby's a little too expensive to <laughs> to take it on a test. How much test for it? How much for it? Uh, I can't even I can't even uh, calculate how much it was. Would it cost more than the uh, Honda hydrogen fuel cell? No, that car <laughs> that car's in the millions, I think. Uh, well, I'm not sure about Hondas, but ours is. Um, okay.